Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Horace and you're watching Possible Now and today guys I'm going to guide you about that how you can fix the ESPD IES error on Nintendo Switch in Fortnite and this video is going to be really simple and short so just watch the video till the end and if you need this channel kind of like this video share to your friends and subscribe to the channel for more content and without any waste of time let's start the video. So guys step number one here is we need to access the system settings. So from your switch home screen select the gear icon to open the system settings and scroll down and select the system from the menu and step number two here is we need to clear the console cache files. So scroll all the way down to formatting options and note here if you have a parental controls enabled you will need to enter your pin first. Select clear cache and it's the first option choose your user profile if you have multiple accounts and when the confirmation appears select reset. Important note here that don't let the warning message scare you this process is completely safe I have done this multiple times without any issues and it won't affect your game saves or account data. And step number three here is we need to simply restart your switch. Hold down to power button for three seconds select power options from the menu that appears and choose the restart and wait for your switch to reboot and the final step here is you need to once your switch finishes restarting launch Fortnite as you normally would all your skins progress and account information will still be there so guys by applying these simple steps your problem will be fixed and if you found this video helpful kind of like this video share to your friends and subscribe to the channel for more content and we will meet in the next one until then peace out